Hey, what's up, guys? This is Ron Dodge from Remax Lake of the Ozarks. Hey, welcome to the July 2020 edition of Ron Dodge Sells the Lake and Lake of the Ozark Dream Home. I hope you all had a fantastic 4th of July weekend. Uh, this is Monday morning, July 6th. I'm recording this. Uh, another record-breaking week, weekend here at the lake, Memorial Weekend, and now 4th of July weekend have been some of the biggest ever. Um, just a quick update on the market. Um, it's still as hot as can be here at the lake. If you are interested in a property um, and it's priced well in a good location, it, they go fast. Um, case in point, I had one of my clients, Rollin, uh, shout out to Rollin, um, Saturday morning texted me about a property. I was, had prior engagements, couldn't get out there till Sunday, set up an appointment and I got a call from the listing agent saying that the, uh, the property already had multiple offers and at least one of them was over asking price. So properties are going fast, properties are tight right now. Um, but that doesn't mean that they're not out there and they're not available. You just have to be sharp and be quick to the point to, uh, to get a good property. So let's jump right into the June stats and uh, you'll see what I'm talking about. Okay guys, let's go ahead and jump right into the numbers here for the month of June. Uh, Fourth of July weekend, as I've just mentioned, was a fantastic weekend here at the lake. More people are staying close to home, staying off the airplanes and uh, doing a lot more staycation. So the lake's been hopping all summer and this past 4th of July weekend is no exception. Uh, in June, 418 properties sold. Uh, 275 of those were single family. Uh, 260 of those single family were lakefront. 143 were condos and villas. The lowest priced uh, home sold for $29,900 and the highest price was $2,175,000. 143 bill lists closed in June, 12 sold from zero to 100,000. Six of those were lakefront. 112 sold between 100 and 300,000. 90 of those were lakefront. 17 sold between 300 and 500,000. 15 were lakefront. And two sold for over 500,000. Both were lakefront. The highest closed villa condo sold was for $950,000. And here's a picture of the front door, beautiful villa. All right, moving over to single family, we had 275 single family homes closed in June. Uh, 29 sold for a zero to 100,000, three were lakefront. 149 sold between 100 and 300,000, 61 of those were lakefront. 64 sold between 300 and 500,000, 52 of those were lakefront. 32 sold between 500 and a million, as you can see 30 were lakefront and four sold for over a million dollars in June. All four of those were lakefront. The highest priced home was $2,175,000. And here's the picture of a beautiful home. All right, as we move over to the current market conditions, again, like I said, the market's pretty tight right now. There are only 187 condos, villas on the market. Um, 70 units are priced at zero to 250,000, um, 104, units are priced from 250 to 500,000 and then there's 13 that are 500,000 plus in the condo villa market. Single family homes there are 556 of those on the market uh, 0 to 250,000 or 262 or the vast majority of that number 56 are lakefront uh, 250 to 500,000 is there's 160 units on the market 500,000 to a million 94 with 61 of those being lakefront and there are currently 53 homes on the market for over a million dollars. 47 of those are lakefront. So there you have it, guys. This, the June stats uh, play out, as I, as I mentioned earlier, that, uh, that properties here at the lake are moving fast. Um, if you're interested in a property or you have any questions about real estate here at the Lake of the Ozarks, or if you'd like to know the value of your property here at Lake of the Ozarks, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. Um, my name is Ron Dodge again. My number is 573-578-9025. Um, I'd love to work with you and help you in any way I can. Hope you guys have a great July, a great summer, and stay safe out there. Thanks, guys.